Yeah, that program is called the Ag and Youth Grant Program. And it's exactly what it sounds like. It provides funding for youth and um, projects that are made up by youth who are interested in getting into the agriculture industry. Now, the Pennsylvania Department of Agriculture is saying that it's to help address a looming workforce shortage expected over the next decade, and that was helped determine after a continuous rise in job openings. And Mitch here, we're at Shelmar Acres, but Mitch, you have a very nice farm, a lot of cows up and early, but tell me how, a little bit, how, how, how have these shortages affected you currently? Yeah, sure. I mean, we have a small team here, so we're not looking to hire all the time. But uh, when we do, last year we had a guy leave and we were looking to fill that role and we found it was pretty hard to find people. I think there's a kind of a specific uh, person that we're looking for when it comes to someone at the farm. And so having a small pool to start with uh, makes, makes filling those roles pretty hard. And Mitch, I know you emphasize education a lot on your social media. So tell me a little bit about why agriculture is so important for you, both your family and the Commonwealth of Pennsylvania. Yeah, sure. I mean, agriculture is a lifestyle for us. So it's it's what we live and breathe. So it's really important for us as a family. But as as a community and as a state, um, agriculture is is our food source and so i think it's really important that that's uh that's a strong part of our of our uh yeah focus that we can keep that that food source strong and growing and uh that's what it's all about all right thank you mitch well you can apply for that grant program on the pennsylvania department of agriculture's website and you have until september 29th to do that reporting in lancaster county jake reyes wgal news 8.